Hello everyone, welcome to Koshka. There is a saying here that goes like this. One who has never been to Koshka has never been to Xinjiang, which shows the significance of this location. And today, I think you may have noticed I'm all dressed up in traditional Uyghur attire. And my topic will be the Uyghur hat that I'm wearing right now, which is called a doper in English. And these colorful embroidered square hats are usually associated with Uyghur people here. And if we look at this from above, it is square in shape and the diagonal lines have divided the hat into four triangles. And actually the history of the doper traces way back to China's Tang Dynasty over a thousand years ago. And today, let me bring you to one of the doper shops here in Kashgar. And here you may find all different types of hats for men, for women or children, and the hats have integrated a variety of different colors, red, white, black, pink, blue or green, you name it. And just to find these colors so dazzling and overwhelming. And here, I think this hat, his design is quite like mine, but its pattern is badam, uh, which is a kind of local food. It symbolizes good health and prosperity in Xinjiang. And this one apparently is designed for a little girl and as you can see it has been decorated with glittering and colourful sequels and of course you can always find a hat like this one with breeze attached. And actually in Xinjiang, quite similar to anywhere else in the world, the younger generations are not as traditional or conventional as their parents or grandparents. But the hat culture here remains prevalent and people wear them on many special occasions like big parties or some big events or big celebrations. Of course, if you come to Xinjiang, definitely try one on.